very often women get asked ki work life balance kaise hota hai like how do you take care of the child and work i'm going to reverse the question so how do you balance so this not enough here i see other fathers and i feel sometimes ashamed that i'm not doing as they are doing mm. in the morning they go to drop their daughters to school i i'm not sometimes go to fetch her from school that is fine but i'm not playing with her much i'm not teaching her how to cycle so i'm not very happy with that no doubt but i'm trying now i'm trying to divide time thank you for coming to humans of bombay welcome This thank you thank you krishna thank it, you so much it's a new studio we Lovely. just it's, built it's beautiful it. and when i entered the office the best part uh, uh, part was it's spacious it's yeah. open <laughs> it's very full of light so i think i like such kind of offices and studios yeah wo jo cramped up hote na ha we like openness yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> chote gaon se chote shehar se na khula khula sab kuch so we we wanted to start the interview mm. on a anecdote that you've mentioned ki mm. shahrukh khan had once said mm. something that taught mm. you an important lesson yeah which is i work more than i'm paid for yeah is that something you've implemented obviously yes obviously yes you know when you do any project i think mm. the producer or the director you know they obviously you charge for that work and obviously uh as a producer is in fact i am a producer so mm-hmm. and i think here ye itna paisa diya itna kaam to le lenge isse mm-hmm. so there is always a you know uh, there is always a give and take kind of mm-hmm. understanding between uh, both the parties but here what he taught me that okay fine whatever he is giving you i think if you'll give more than return i think the um, returns in future will be much more better mm-hmm. yeah. as a, as a, as a human also correct So I think I follow that now, and uh, though obviously at home there's a issue, issue that why do you work so much? But mm. yeah, because sometimes we don't, you know, work for uh, that particular uh, money or mm. uh, reward. I think we just work to give your best. Correct. So I I, I believe in that that and unless uh, somebody who's paying me is not. contented or happy with my work i think the work is not finished correct so i think my approach is like that ki tu khush hai na bhai chal ab bata you mentioned that you grew up in a small town yep. in gwalior uh, is there something that you miss about those days uh, what was your childhood like have you always been like this hard no, working no. no no hard working obviously yes yeah. i was i was uh, till that i i a lot of people now give a, started giving this compliment you're a good actor or something I, I, so i always tell them i'm not a good actor i'm a smart actor mm-hmm. so i think i was a smart kid i think when i it, it comes to study also uh, because nobody had must have seen me studying or you know doing homework in the post school or mm-hmm. in the evening or in the afternoon or maybe in the night so they used to uh, ask me to homework kab karta hai mm-hmm. So, yeah, my school time is seven twenty. I wake up at five thirty and do my homework. Wow! So I used to finish that in the morning, so that I have full day to, to me, yeah. whatever I want to do. Nobody can scold me. Nobody can say anything. <laughs> so I think that that thing I uh, applied in my life that you need to be a little smarter rather than obviously if you're good then it's okay, but you need to be a little smarter also. Hmm. So I was and but only issue was that since childhood I was stammerer. Yeah. So I used to stammer a lot. So I think that was one hindrance in my life, which was stopping me for doing a lot of things. Mm. But uh, otherwise, childhood was very good here. Yeah. And then small towns, and as you know, you you value things. That's a that's the best part of small towns. You value small small things, small small achievements. I still remember, and because uh, you know you're from a lower middle class family and. So I used to have a cycle, and I was growing very tall. So I had a hero cycle, which was small, and they were a cycle. And since I mean, till I think I was ninth or tenth, I used to ride that cycle, it was a smaller one. And that too, not one, not the, this one. That was the handle one. Yeah, like, like tiny. Ha, tiny. What is it? 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 Then a film came called Joy of the Sikandar. Wow. And I asked him, "Mama, I need this cycle. What gear shift? 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 What gear sh
now nobody values such kind of things i think cycle aage chalo theek hai cycle aage hai ek car bhi aage to nobody reacts like that theek hai char thi ek bar aage panch bhi so i think that value thing was much more bigger that time in small town if you look if you look at you today yep. nobody even dream that you used to stammer you're known for your voice for yeah. having a deep baritone <laughs> how did you overcome that uh, so i have said it in multiple interviews and multiple occasions <clears throat> because i had what i suffered i don't want kids to suffer in in that way uh, so there are few which are uh, i think neurological stammering and few are maybe Uh, a physical issue with your uh, uh, with you so uh, means you might have a breathing issue you might have a uh, you know you will call it us kehte hain ki iska ek word hai alsi jeev hai aapki aisa bolte hain small town mein ha you know slow tongue you you can so and sometimes you think very fast and you can't, can't speak, speak in that speed up. so the stammering comes from there so you have to analyze what exactly is the issue with you so it took me a lot of time when obviously when things comes to your head and you think start thinking ki yaar agar ye theek nahi kiya to then you are you are nowhere mm-hmm. so that situation was then and marta kya na karta which we say <laughs> and i said ki i have to think about it ki why it is happening to me sometimes i don't stammer sometimes i i stuck on some word or something why it's happening then i realized ki my breathing pattern was wrong completely wrong so i worked on it and um, i observed a lot of actors a lot of people how they speak why they speak so fluently why they speak why 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 they sound so nice mm-hmm. so i understood with me particularly there was a breathing issue okay. so i just corrected that it's not 100% gone but still yeah it's I it's mean, <laughs> it's yeah, 100% on the no, no, no. appearance of it uh, a lot of times i get stuck Mm-hmm. while doing a scene also there's okay. because there are few words which needs a specific kind of breathing right few letters basically not words also if a sentence starting from that letter i'll i'll get stuck <laughs> and, and and if it's in middle of a, a long monologue yeah. then to it's it takes a while it takes a while to get right then i speak very slow and then mm. so it's it's a process but yeah you can overcome stammering so if, guys if you have the issue please try to understand why do you have hmm. and then uh, try to rectify it and is it after you rectify that uh, you did a lot of like you did a lot of different things first year i got electrical engineering yeah that, engineering then i mean you didn't uh, pursue i didn't pursue that yeah. then i did my sports management degree in uh, physical education for three years and then i did my mba MB. in marketing systems mm. and then so, actor how <laughs> the universe my ben i got a liberty i think my <laughs> mom had faith in me that whatever he'll do he'll excel i think so that faith worked i think whatever i wanted to do i got the opportunity to do it first of all and that opportunity is very important for any mm. uh, anybody who want to explore first mm. of all and you know Uh, we are a very stu- uh, 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 stereotype in small towns you know what your cousins have done you have to do that mm. if you in the family your brother is an engineer so you have to follow that if somebody is done science so you do take science what pressure hota hai i wanted to break free i said i, I will not follow this mm. i'll i'll make my own way or i'll choose my own path so i kept on trying different so because why uh, sports and physical science because I wanted to go in the army, hmm. so okay, fine. Studies wise, I was okay. I I knew that I'll clear CDS, but for other stuff, for I need that. You know, you have to be active and all. So I chose that. Okay, I'll be very fit for. So I cleared as CDS. I went for SSB, and uh, screening was cleared. And then the last interview, I was out. So things happen, and then I did my MBA, <laughs> and. actually that mba phase was very important because i started doing part time modeling there hmm lamba chhoda lag raha hai dikhne mein theek thak hai pocket money mil jata hai and one of my friend he like he really pushed me ki why don't you go for grassims and yeah, i don't know i can't there mujhe to english bolna nahi aata hmm. like in all the pageants and these kind of things you know you need to know hmm. a very fluent english and in small towns we don't speak 
we are not allowed to speak in english or <laughs> we don't have intent to learn hmm. uh, because zarurat nahi hai hindi mein baat chal rahi hai to kya karna hai वैसे भी आई स्टडी इन हिंदी मीडियम सो वैसे ही हाथ तंग था मेरा बहुत ज़्यादा सो यू नो दे दे लिट पुश्ट मी कि नहीं नहीं नाउ डेज हिंदी इज ओके इन दीज काइंड ऑफ रीजन इफ यू आर सेइंग एल गो फ्रॉम देयर द जर्नी स्टार्टेड ऑफ बिकमिंग एन एक्टर बिफोर दैट देर वाज नो ड्रीम नो स्टेज नथिंग नो एक्टिंग नो ड्रामा आई हैवंट सीन एनी प्ले बिफोर दैट वाओ एंड वंस यू केम हियर एंड यू स्टार्टेड गेटिंग यू स्टार्टेड वॉकिंग द रैम यू स्टार्टेड गेटिंग फ्यू रोल्स How are you managing financially from small town to Bombay? ये ये सवाल हमेशा आता है कि कैसे होगा expense wise. Obviously, um, was and I was tough? very clear from day one, and my family per se was very very clear from day one that, uh, but if you need anything, please ask from us. Don't ask from somebody else. Somebody else. So I was very clear that yeah, I have a support, but I have to be in my limits. I have to check my pockets every time. So I used to get work, but not very regularly. After the first year, the first year when you're out of the grass, you get shows also, you get ads also, you get uh, print shoots also. But after the year, the, when the new lot comes, you are the old ones, and then the struggle starts. So yeah, there were times you had to lie to your parents. No, no, it's all teacher kind of thing. But then you have to, you know, struggle through that, and that's the best uh, best phase I think <coughs> for anyone who want to achieve something big. because if you struggle if you you know work hard and if you uh, pass that tough zone mm. so there are lot of things in future will not trouble you like one of like today's a major concern is depression i think there are a lot of people are with small issues or maybe big issues trigger it's a, it's a very medical issue but the trigger point is sometimes it's very psychological and if you you know if you struggle so much if you cross that path Uh, with your uh, will, I think, then things in future are very easy. I think mm. it's, it's it's very easy to uh, overcome these things. Mm. So I think that phase taught me and how uh, means how to be happy in your life. Yeah. Because uh, there's no money. Uh, still, you are having fun mm. in those few rupees and. You this, said uh, yeah. You said in an interview that. Uh, You used to share a room with like nine other people yeah, yeah, at yes. one point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We all still friends. We, we nine of us, <laughs> mm. and uh, there was no kitchen in the house. There was nothing in the house because they were all bachelors here. Mm. So we used to call for dabba from outside just to eat that, and it's, it's, I can't because I have to maintain my physique also. And that should there were two more actors used to stay with me. So I said, and they were they didn't know how to cook. So I said, okay, then the hostel boy will do everything. I'll teach you, but you have to follow. Hmm. So literally, I taught all of them how to make the basic oh. food. Oh, wow! Okay, and specialties I'll do. Hmm. I'll I'll give you fish fry also. I'll give you chicken also. But dal chawal banana seek lo yar, because that is the basics of <laughs> kitchen. Yeah. So I said, okay, you learn, and then I asked the landlord to make a platform, give me some gas connection, and. Chula, we bought a second hand fridge, a TV, and lot of other things. So I made the the bachelor pad in a into a house where nine members are staying together. Mm. And uh, I think that was one of the best phases of my life. Er, कुछ पैसे नहीं होते थे. दो हफ्ते में एक बार चलो आज कुछ fish fish बनाते हैं. Let's कुछ drinks order करते हैं. We'll take आते हैं कहीं से. All जुगाड़ है मतलब. तू पचास रुपए दे, तू सौ रुपए दे. <laughs> But I used to have fun that yeah. time. I, I was never sad in hmm. that zone. Hmm. And whenever I needed money, I used to call my mother and sister. Hmm. Yeah, are खत्म हो गए अभी. अब तो चाहिए. अब तो दे दो. खत्म हो गए. And that time, I think uh, obviously it was a uh, big load on their pockets. But they knew that this boy is going to do something. So that trust, I think, was there on me. That's why they didn't think uh, for a single time also that we. अभी नहीं है बाद में देखते हैं माय फैमिली आई थिंक दे सपोर्टेड वे सपोर्टेड यू ऑल द बिग ब्रेक कह सकते हैं वाज दूरदर्शन आक्रोश दैट यू डिड व्हाट वाज दैट फेज लाइक डिड यू फील लाइक चलो अब गाड़ी मूव कर रही है नॉट रियली एक्चुअली आई टेल यू गाड़ी मूव बिकॉज़ जस्ट 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 बिफोर दैट आई वाज आई गॉट अ शो ऑन अ जीसी चैनल एंड Uh, in five days, I got I got replaced because I had to stammer. So when I was doing, when I got uh, this show called Lakrosh, it was a weekly show. 
but still i think i was not 100% sure that i am i am doing what the director wants from me theek hai kaam chal raha hai so it was a very calm chal raha kind of calm it was not that big break i think for me big break happened maybe in at se saath phir i think which yeah. i did yeah or before that sindur also because acceptance was there in sindur but the big break per se i think saath phir was one show which went the success went out of the roof i think <laughs> every but nobody imagined that this show can do so well yeah and i can say that that show made me overnight star sure. in, in 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 television and it was a fluke i if i'll tell you a story mm. it'll be one thing so i signed the show for a 30 episode cameo that uh, there and when i entered in the show as the heroine's husband and the, the wedding sequence was going on the ratings doubled and then tripled and four times and it went at that level that no other show was at that trp ratings so the makers had to think you know what to do we this guy came and the ratings have gone so up people are liking their jodi so what to do and they changed the storyline completely because because okay. the track was working so from one month cameo to a three year three and a half years show mm-hmm. i think it's you can say it's a big, big breaking yeah. and how did life change when you got the you know hmm. teen saal ka contract mila teen saal ka contract to 6 mahine ka tha 6 mahine ka extend ho gaya <laughs> extend but obviously it was uh very because before the show only i uh, i got married to kirti and mm-hmm. you know we had few dreams together we seen few dreams together that for the house or you know aisa ghar chahiye waisa ghar chahiye thi and holidays and all and that was happening in front of our eyes everything was falling in place i think that was a very wonderful time and uh, and we made sure that time uh, that uh, we want to spend quality time with each other so every month we used to take uh, four days off in spite of that she is doing some other show i am doing some other show but we used to manage those four to five days apart from the sundays mm. that we will go to some place and we will spend those four days together so i think everything was planned and mm. uh, as as a decision also i think we decided that time after marriage that we will not have kids right now we'll wait and then this we are happy we have seen enough we we waited for that also for 7 years and then kasha was born Daughter, yeah. how was the feeling of the first house the first car <laughs> the first gift you bought your mother yeah. sister how was that i think the the very important thing for me in my life i think was a house hmm. which uh, i always dreamt of that uh, because we never had our our house in gwalior also there were four cousins. my father had three more brothers so property was in dispute that it was again four so we didn't we never had our own house so owning your house now it was it was a special big feeling. special feeling and and I, you know and we still remember i wrote in a diary that i need a not a small house i need a three bedroom hall and with this 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 kind of and exactly that, that kind of house we bought so the feeling was amazing and uh, touchwood and my that was the best gift for my mom also because mm-hmm. she also from uh, that ki if we would have been uh, having our own house in those times so but she because, because she stayed uh, stayed in a rented apartment in gwalior aur apna ghar hota to yaar main apne ghar mein rehti chalo ab ye apna ghar aa gaya so now are they here now they yeah, yeah my mom said okay so now i have bought a bigger house around 10 mm-hmm. 12 years back mm-hmm. and the the new house part particularly i'll tell you the story i was shooting in goa mm. and uh, my mother was supposed to come and then the kids plan and you know so you need a bigger house mm. for that and kirti was searching for such and she saw this house i'm saying right now and she called me ghar dekha to dekh le aake said ki main main shooting karunga dekh leta hu aake when i enter in the house now i'll tell you not 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 lying but it, that house is exactly the design which in in the house i used to stay in gwalior it's it's it was very very similar oh. uh, the whole uh, what do you call it the naksha tha na uska hum it was i said ki please don't react na right now i told you don't react nahi to ye bahut paise bada dega agar but then obviously we bought that and uh, loan pe hi hai abhi bhi hmm Uh, but because if you in, in mumbai type of city you want to buy a big house 
आई थिंक लाइफ लॉन्ग यू विल पे द लोन भी पे द लोन कुछ ज्यादा इवन रेंट रेंट टू लेट्स नॉट डिस्कस लोन भी ऐसी चल ही रहा है बट या आई गॉट द काइंड ऑफ हाउस आई वांटेड and then bollywood happened in a bunch of ways you did halchal 1920 and but halchal. i think the <laughs> <laughs> now i think everyone knows the story so i'll not repeat it but no, it was one time yeah, halchal was like a, i like it was a very you know if yeah, so i got a call and i was not doing anything i needed money also that time so i got a call from a producer and said ki we are making this this film and you are opposite kareena kapoor i said great <laughs> I said, "Oh, give me a song also. There are two songs: engagement song and one more song. And then there are scenes with this and that and blah blah. And ultimately, obviously, she'll go with Akshay Khanna. <laughs> but you have a so you know you relate to few films where there are two heroes, you know, <laughs> and both love the same <laughs> girl, and but she falls for the other one. Yeah. I was dreaming about it. I see some picture of you. Nothing was. It was a fun film." But I I I was very happy in that zone also. Okay, at least I am seeing these actors which I used to see on uh, on 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 big screen. Especially Amrish Puri sir, I think mm. uh, a huge fan of his craft, and I got the opportunity to work with him. It was hilarious. Uh, it was a hilarious film, yeah. obviously, and I am a part of it, and I am very proud of it that I worked with Priyadarshan sir and mm. a bunch of great great actors, mm. stars. So far. in fact, recently I told this to Karina also. we are doing a uh uh audible series mm. called wastelanders so she's uh, playing uh, black widows i am mm. playing wolverine mm. so i shared the same thing here you know we did a film together when when <laughs> i said he you might not be remembering but around 13 14 years back i think more than that 18 years back which film i said yeah, which character you played see and i don't remember also what character <laughs> i played Oh, that was you, but it was not your voice. I said, "You know, it's not my voice. Mm-hmm. It's up with, up with someone else." Mm-hmm. So, but it was fun, yeah. So I don't. Earlier, used to hide. I don't ever used to discuss. Don't. Yeah, let's talk about it. But I feel it's okay. Yeah. Everybody has gone through that phase, and it's the journey. It's the journey. It's yeah. a, it's an experience which you you know take in your life and feel happy about it. Yeah. And then, how was Ram Lila? Through audition, <laughs> obviously. So Shruti was. You know, casting for Ram Leela, and uh, precisely before that, I want to just add on that when I finished my first big show as a big breaking show, Saath Pere, what I realized that I'm not growing as an actor. I'm doing the same stuff every day, and Saloni is saying Kari, kind of dialogues every day. So, uh, so I chose not to do similar kind of roles. You won't believe after Saath Pere, I must have got some thirty, forty. Offers for a similar kind of good husband, nice boy, nice son. Mm. I said, no, I can't do this again. I can't do. Obviously, there's big money was there, yeah. actually, but you know. So I chose a show which was completely opposite what I was doing. It was an anti-hero show on mm. first time on TV. Mm. After a show used to come in six nineties. After that, this show was there. It was an anti-hero show. I did that, and people were like, "What are you doing?" तो हीरो था शो का तू क्या कर रहा है तू ऐसे गंदे गंदे काम कर रहा है टीवी के ऊपर ऐसे कि बस एज एन एक्टर मुझे एक्सप्लोर करना है यार कि मैं कर सकता हूं कि नहीं कर सकता हूं एंड देन आई डिड अ एंड देन वन ऑफ माय आई डिड अ शो इन अ स्मॉल गिग इन दुबई एंड देयर वाज अ टीम ऑफ जी दुबई एंड देयर वाज अ गर्ल यू टू वर्क देयर कॉल उत्कर्षनी एंड शी सम ऑल लेफ्ट एंड शी जॉइन सुभन साली एंड दे आर सर्चिंग फॉर एक्टर्स एंड शी कॉल्ड मी आई यू इंटरेस्ट आई कैन यू Leave TV. I mean, that means are you okay to do? I mean, I said it's a Bansali film. Obviously, yes. Mm-hmm. I mean, <laughs> you have to give audition, and I gave the audition and got selected for that part. Mm. But it was a, a completely different world for me. I think I was. I came from a world where we don't have time, we don't have money, we don't have anything. <laughs> anything uh, gracious with us because uh, you know you have to deliver every day. There are budget constraints and a lot of things. Pressure too many actors working in one show, and you know to uh, take out this those twenty two minutes every day and telecast it. Mm-hmm. Different world completely, and Mr. Bansali's world was completely different. It was a shocker, first of all. Abundance. ये क्या हो रहा है यार? इतने सारे लोग हैं अभी तक. But the experience was, I think, something else. 
I, I saw the love for the craft in him. He will not leave until he is satisfied that what he visualized in his thoughts, he could execute on, on or he can present on screen. That's the best part. So I still remember there's one shot with whole Jingmang is dancing and you know, there's thousand people on the set and the song sequence going on. There's one diya was bujha hua. In the frame, piche gahi to bhi A normal filmmaker will not even give a damn about it. Ki ek bujha gahi to pachas se jal rahe. But he, the whole shot was okay. He said ki one more. So this everybody was ki so. Uh, and he scolded me. Oh, diya bandha wa par. Jala usko. I could see that this guy goes into the minute to minute details of filmmaking. Uh, I will not maybe, I will not notice also mm -hmm. when I am watching. But he is so particular about his craft. Mm -hmm. ki dekha hai, mujhe logon ko hai. So unless I am happy with what I am doing here, how will people be happy? Yeah. So I think he is a master of that. Mm -hmm. And it was a completely eye opener for me that Okay, fine, respect your craft, first of all. There's, there's unlimited knowledge and experience in this craft. You have to grab it, you have to mm -hmm. learn that. So, I have to say that I have to do a lot of things so that I have to do a knowledge in a short lifespan. I have to do a lot of things in a short lifespan. First of all, it's the one and I explore it and I'm exploring it. That's why I started doing different kind of roles and different kind of genres. Yeah. I didn't stick to one, that this is my easy way, I'll do it, I'll get success. Yeah, it's a lot of money. I'll become a villain and I'll become a big villain. I don't want to become a villain. So, yeah, there's a different thought all together behind. Uh, my career or maybe what my choices hmm. which I follow karta hmm. even with Bahubali yeah. I think it was path breaking it was <laughs> just in terms of the film like it's uh. a we were just watching uh, the trailer Adipurish trailer Haan, Adipurish. Uh, was that also a turning point because yeah Bahubali uh, obviously for an for like uh, matlab, as, as you said we don't believe that you used to stammer yeah so I think uh, it might create an impact that nothing is impossible because for me, I didn't realize for a long time that I have such kind of voice. Which still, till date, I know it's good, but I don't know how it is because I listen, hear myself every day 24-7. So, I, do, I can't rate it. It doesn't come to you. Yeah, I can't rate it, how, how good it is. Bahubali happened because I was doing a Telugu film. I was acting in a Telugu film opposite Pawan Kalyan sir. Mm -hmm. And uh, somebody recommended my name. There is an actor. Mm -hmm was a voice which might match to Prabhas. And uh, so they called me and I said, yeah, I want to meet Raj Mori sir first. I'm a huge fan of his craft. They said, okay, you give the audition and take the tape yourself only to Raj Kamal Studios. I said, great. So I gave, I gave the uh, voice test and I took the tape to, I met him and he saw me as a, was a, like, he's a very quiet guy, he doesn't speak much. And good, good, nice, uh, okay. I will call you and I'll inform you. I said, okay. By the time I was on my way, the director called me and said, you're okay with, the sir voice. is okay with your voice. That's how probably happened. But and again, till the first part came and I think first two, three months, nobody knew that it was my voice. Yeah. Later when people started talking, the media houses like you, they started talking about, okay, whose voice is it, how impactful it is. Then I think it's blew, it blew out of proportion. I think it was something, I didn't even, I couldn't uh, handle it also. I mean, I'm a fan of Mr. Bachchan's voice or Kabir Gudi Sahib, or Vijay Raz, for example, or so, Raza Murad Ji. So, I think it changed a complete perspective about dubbing industry also. Mm -hmm. Now you see, I think, Shreyas is dubbing or something. A lot, of, a lot of other actors are dubbing for each other. I think Dhruba was one film and Ajay Devgan said dub for Ram Charan. Hmm. So there are few things which are happening. Actors are dubbing for each other. I think it's a good thing for the industry also. You get a better quality of production. Production. Yeah. So I think uh, for me also it was hmm. uh, revenue wise also it was better. <laughs> uh, That's what counts. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes you need that. 
सो यू नो वेरी ऑफन वुमेन गेट आस्ट कि वर्क लाइफ बैलेंस कैसे होता है लाइक हाउ डू टेक केयर ऑफ द चाइल्ड एंड वर्क I'm 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 going to reverse the question because you 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 said that you work a lot and yeah, of course you work a lot. Work all and uh, you also share a very deep bond with your daughter and it's evident that you know you spend time enjoy being a father. So how do you balance? So it's not enough here. I see other fathers and I feel sometimes ashamed that I'm not doing as they are doing. Mm. In the morning they go to drop their daughters to school. I I'm not sometimes go to fetch her from school. That is fine, but I'm not playing with her much i'm not teaching her how to cycle so i'm not very happy with that no doubt but i'm trying now i'm trying to divide time uh, so sunday offs is one thing which i started i'll not work on sundays i will give how long ago did you start sundays off it's been now almost two years said and no sundays uh, mostly sometimes it is it's a, if it's in the middle of the schedule and it's unavoidable then obviously you mm. have to but otherwise i opt for sunday off mm-hmm. and i don't go anywhere it's not like that ki sunday mai meeting kar leta hu kisi ya mai dubbing kar leta hu aur let's go out with friends for uh, evening session or something no i never go out i now i don't go out for parties i know i don't go out for socializing i don't go to restaurants i i hardly go out so my stuck my work schedule is very i finish my work i'll go to gym i'll come home mm-hmm. what about time i can give to them but still is not enough i i am i can i feel very sorry about it but i want to change that in my life i want to give more time to my daughter so there's mom guilt you have dad guilt yeah i have dad guilt yeah 100% and you know you do stuff for your kids but i think it's not enough i think right now at this time they need much more from you and uh, i'm trying because earlier so i was behind because this Both the things happened at the same time. My daughter was born, and I started getting films. Mm-hmm. So my whole attention towards films, and but as an EA, I didn't give time to her. But the kind of time I should give, or uh, but the, uh, one advantage there, the father daughter bond is always there. So I think <laughs> that is not missing. Mm-hmm. She loves me a lot. Uh, in fact, today morning also, I after long, I went to drop her home, uh, drop her school. Mm-hmm. Uh, so she was very happy. and i can see the smile when i go to fetch her from school and i'm standing mm-hmm. and waiting for her and when she comes out and she smiles ah, that is there so that is priceless here yeah so mai koshish karunga ki mai zyada se zyada waqt de paun and you know once you not in the position but once you reach a, a stage where you can choose that what to do and what not to do obviously in the initial time you have to do whatever it's coming to you but at If with your hard work you reach to a certain place, still that place is too far from me. But still, I can choose. Uh, okay, fine. What not to do? Mm. And what not to? That that time I want to give it to her. Yeah. I want to divide that uh, time with her, and and she also understands though that my dad is an actor and he's a very uh, irregular schedule. So mm. she is quite mature to her age. age. Yeah. Any lesson that you're trying to teach her that you've learned? from your one parents. thing I, i i tell everyone i think and i think that's uh, goes with the life also it took a lot of time to teach my wife but <laughs> she learned finally uh, you know i used to tell everyone that if you are good at maths your life my dad used to tell me this if you're good at maths your life will be very easy how so always in any situation you calculate इसमें अच्छा क्या है इसमें बुरा क्या है एंड आई एम 100 परसेंट श्योर दैट अच्छा का नंबर ज्यादा होगा hmm. बुरा का कम होगा सो यू मैथ कम्स देयर सो आई ऑलवेज टेल की मैथ्स में अच्छा जॉब बेटा तो बहुत होशियार बनोगे आगे जाके खुश रहोगे लाइफ में सो इन एनी एडवर्स सिचुएशन आई कैलकुलेट ओके फाइन आई हैव दिस 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 सो आई हैव सेवन गुड थिंग्स ओके फाइन वन टू बैड थिंग्स आर दे सो इंपॉर्टेंट that they can overshadow those seven good mm. things no mm. so i am sad you can be happy so that's a motto which i follow and uh, uh, to relate to that there's one more thing which it's a, it's a funny incidence mm. but it's a, it's a, it's my life philosophy one point i was sitting and i <coughs> turned to my wife and my my mom is not happy with me daughter is not happy with me. you are not happy with me 
सो वॉट आई एम हैप्पी सो आइडिया इज दैट इफ यू आर हैप्पी देन ओनली यू कैन मेक अदर्स हैप्पी Correct. If you're sad, then you're obviously you're spreading the sadness yeah. to I think everyone. So you need to be happy first, and you have to start thinking about ki ab how you can be happy hmm. in any situation. Yeah. So you have you. I mean, I always followed that. Hmm. I mean, it came from my dad. I never saw him sad or depressed or. Uh, so I, I I learned from him that you need to be happy. Yeah. Hmm. So I try to be that. And looking back. What are some of the milestones or highlights? Any incident have you that that you always remember? Somebody complimented you. Somebody said something, and you're like, "Wow." That is the most important. But there are few things which I think which changed uh, my life pretty much. I think that obviously when I got my wife, she's a lady luck for me. I think the great support in my life. Uh, without her, it's very difficult. Uh, for a person like me to survive mm-hmm. uh, and live a healthy life <laughs> uh, and uh, secondly the biggest i think the turning point as a human uh, i would say who which changed me completely uh, almost to a, dif- a very high degree uh, the day my daughter was born i think from a boy i became a man i think mm. Uh, in my thought process, obviously, I become much more calmer, uh, much more relaxed, and uh, I think caring has always been, but I was a little careless. So I, I think I became more careful about things. Uh, I value now because earlier has to be the guy, I got another, but I value things now. Yeah, and. Uh, so i think that change was needed in my life uh, you can see the difference in my career also in the kind of work i am doing mm. which is which is much more better and uh, uh, likable after cash was born from 2014 whatever work i have done like so, family man like uh, the choices became better, better i think yeah. um from the um, from uh, Family man to Bahu Bali to uh, Tana Ji to Lakshmi to what are films I have done? What are work I have done? I think uh, your decision making has changed yeah. because of these elements, which mm. which are the change elements in my life. Mm. So that one turning point was, and uh, I have I have uh, because of stammering I had an anger issue. Mm. I think that anger issue has subsided a lot. After yeah. my daughter is born, you yeah. need to become Calm. calmer, stable. in life, yeah. stable in life. So all thanks to her. <laughs> I do thanks to my wife. <laughs> She got her shine. Both the women in your Both. life. Yeah, yeah, all three of them. All three of oh. them. Yeah. And what next? What do you see for yourself? Ah, <sighs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of work? <laughs> I love any... acting here. I love any kind of any acting. Maybe it's voice or it's any medium or. Only, uh, and I was I, I want to explore more. Yeah, I want to be there. Right? A lot of people, like sometimes a lot of people meet you and they say, "Why is star over here, Tuto?" I'm going to say, "Come back out there." Still chasing. Still chasing the, mm-hmm. and uh, uh, hopefully, I think maybe the time is as such right now. Keep. your work will speak for you mm. so i'm trying to do different kind of work if you see this year now uh, you my one film came up uh, uh, chonikal ke bhaga mm. recently and chatrapati came recently and now the lineup will start maybe we're starting from adi purush uh, it looks fantastic yeah, of course yeah. and you know it's because we always heard and seen and you know rama and we have heard and from uh, dadis and nanis and stories and for us obviously is god so uh, you know being a voice of ram is something so else something else i think it's it's a and i've been very fortunate that i i played chatrapati shivaji maharaj mm. again a lifetime achievement for any maharashtrian and uh, it's it's a pride for any any actor and then the 
voice of Ram. I think it's uh, it's a it's a, a big feather in my cap. Mm. Uh, and and there, there are a lot of uh, audio work is coming now. Uh, so to name it as first is this. Very you know, good. always a fan of Marvel. Yeah. And yeah. now you are the Wolverine, so it's uh, and it's my favorite it's character. Yeah. yeah it's, so it's I, I'm loving it. Mm. Uh, and then a couple of series, and there's one 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 very beautiful series coming, I think. Uh, and uh, I still know that a lot of people who are a fan of a show which I did in 2012 called Kushto Lok Kahenge. Mm. It was uh, a love story of a mature doctor and an intern doctor. It was a hospital-based medical drama. But more or more of a love story, mm. uh, uh, less of a hospital drama. But a show which is coming called Doctors on Jio, I think that is one of the different kind of shows which people are expecting me for a long time that I'll do. It's a romantic, it's 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 drama. It's mm. not it's not hard hitting dialogues or action or something <laughs> like that. It's a very sweet, nice feel good. Feel good, but very lot of tension there because it's a medical drama. Mm. So it's a very interesting one which is which is coming. I think maybe in a month or two it will come. Mm. And, what's, and then my my, my Tamil deb uh, debut is there in in uh, Diwali this this year. Wow. In, with Shiva Karthik in. So that I'm looking forward for that film. It's a one of a kind film made in India. So you have to look out for that. Yeah. It's a very interesting one. So big stuff coming. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> 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 okay. <laughs> Amazing. Okay. Now we're gonna do something interesting. We're gonna give you like two options. Okay. And which way would you go? What would you do? Mm -hmm. Okay. What would you do if you were offered to... I'm a Libran by the way, so... <laughs> <laughs> what would you do if you were offered two equally promising film roles? One, a challenging character in a critically acclaimed film. Mm -hmm. Or the other, lead in a commercial blockbuster. Lead in a commercial blockbuster. Okay. And there's a reason for that or...? Because I've done... Uh, the, uh, the, the, the critically the acclaimed... Stuff, uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. If you're to make a decision of relocating, or traveling extensively for work, hmm. how would you strike a balance between doing what's right for your career and what's right for your family? I have to relocate. I'm trying for that only. <laughs> like <now. laughs> Oh, really? Where? Yeah. It's just very difficult now to, you know, in Mumbai, it's it's really congested and, you know, you're, for an artist, I think it's very difficult because there's right. a lot of things are happening around you and you can't really concentrate or so. Not now, but maybe in future. Hmm. I'll take a, take, I'll make a house close by to more greener vicinity. <laughs> yeah. What would you do if you and your wife had a conflicting approach to parenting when it comes to raising your daughter? <laughs> yeah, sometimes. So what do you do? I give up. Oh, you give up. Okay. Uh, she knows better. She's a mother. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so I think she knows better. And, and trust that. I, I can't give her trust. Yeah. Amazing. I don't do bias. I, I, I can't actually. So I tell. So a so lot of people used to ask us, why don't both of you fight? Hmm. You all don't fight. We don't because there's a reason to it. Hmm. So whenever we fight, so <laughs> we fight, and that heat of a moment when you're fighting, I start stammering, and she starts laughing. <laughs> so how will you fight if somebody's laughing at you? Yeah. <laughs> Obviously laugh, we will laugh. Yeah. So that's why we don't fight because we knew we, we know that the moment the fight will start, I'll start stammering. <laughs> so no point. Let's not get no there. No point. Let's get there. Solve it. Sorry. Then <laughs> simple. Finished. Amazing. Last questions. Yep. Um, you know, you started off stammering. <sighs> to today, you are doing voiceovers even for Hollywood films. Yep. So in a way, your weakness was made your strength. Hmm. Your voice. What advice would you give to people whose weaknesses are being focused upon hmm. and low care ki tum kar nahi paoge? Pehle matlab dusro ki baatein sunna ban kar do yaar. Sabse bada problem hai life mein. Hmm. Ki we give value to others opinions and their comments. You have to analyze yourself. And aapko wo sochna zaruri hai ki aapko kya chahiye life mein. Aur jo प्रॉब्लम है वो कितना बड़ा हिंड्रेंस है उस चीज़ को अचीव करने के लिए अगर आपको लगता है रेशो अगेन मैथ्स कम्स 
आपको लगता है कि ये 50 परसेंट के ऊपर जा रहा है तो फोकस ऑन द प्रॉब्लम वाई इट इज हैपनिंग फ्रॉम वेयर इट्स कमिंग इसकी हिस्ट्री क्या है इसके रेमेडीज क्या है एंड आई एम श्योर इफ यू कॉन्सेंट्रेट इनफ आपको रास्ता मिल जाएगा mm. हमारा प्रॉब्लम क्या है ना कि हम सोचते सोचते चार लोगों की बातें ज्यादा सुनते हैं वो नहीं सुननी है बिकॉज अगर ध्यान वहां जाएगा तो आप इस पर कॉन्सेंट्रेट नहीं कर सकते सो so, मेरी फिलोसफी है कि ओके फाइन इफ यू थिंक आप मुझे बोलते रहोगे चार चीजों को लेकर चार लोग मुझे बोलेंगे तो मुझे फर्क नहीं पड़ेगा एंड देनलेस मैं उस चीज पर फोकस करूं कि यार ये क्यों है ये किस लिए हुआ ये इसका बैक स्टोरी क्या है अच्छा मैं यहां से क्या हुआ सपोज आई प्ले क्रिकेट सपोज फॉर एग्जाम्पल बाय स्पोर्ट अगर मेरे मसल मेमोरी में एक पर्टिकुलर मोमेंट नहीं है तो मुझे कितना भी कोई सिखा ले जाके वो आएगा ही नहीं कभी आई डू थिंक यार क्यों मैं गलत शॉट मार रहा हूँ क्यों मेरा ऐसा बॉल इस तरफ भाग रहा है बोलिंग करते हुए क्योंकि मेरा हाथ यहाँ से मूव कर रहा है अच्छा इसको कैसे करना चाहिए तो बहुत इंटरनल एक सिस्टम है जिस जो आपको ढूंढना पड़ेगा और बहुत मुश्किल नहीं होगा hmm. अगर ध्यान देंगे तो हम प्रॉब्लम ये तो हम दूसरे की भी चीजों पर ज्यादा ध्यान देते हैं <laughs> खुद पे कम देते हैं channel and hit that bell icon. Thank you all for being the best community and I'll see you soon.